Everybody is talking about the plant of the future, the Internet of Things, the connected plant. But what challenges will industry's latest incarnation bring? And how will it affect businesses, the organization of work, and more broadly, the economy? First, we need to understand the sheer scope of the phenomenon. Put simply, it is the fourth industrial revolution. And like the previous three industrial revolutions, this one is fueled by transformation on an unprecedented scale. The advent of renewable energy is driving a massive energy transition away from fossil fuels. The digital revolution is shaping how we communicate and giving us new tools to do it. The way work and society in general are organized is changing. The Internet is the symbol of this industrial revolution. It is both a driver and enabler of change. Interconnectedness, ubiquitous communication and data sharing, in short, the real-time networking we engage in on a daily basis, whether it is with people around the block or across the globe, is now spreading to the industrial sector. And at the same time, energy management strategies are reaching maturity. Renewables are now part of the energy equation. Energy-positive buildings are becoming increasingly common. Cities are experimenting with smart grids. This fast-paced environment is rife with opportunities for industrial end-users to lower their production-related energy bills and building operation costs. Whether it's for energy or communication, the transition we are now seeing is characterized by a shift from the current centralized and vertical model toward a horizontal production, distribution and consumption model, which is where the Internet of Things comes in. When objects are connected, each individual person, machine, building, process unit, and service provider has direct access to all of the others. But what does the Internet of Things mean for industry? It means an entirely new way of doing things. Industrial models are changing from process design to production methods, and the balance of power between customers and suppliers is also changing. The new model is horizontal, and the plant of the future smarter and more agile than today's plants. So what will the plant of the future look like? The plant of the future will look much like today's plants. Industrial end users are not going to start tearing down their plants to build new ones. However, they will integrate new capabilities that address issues crucial to competitiveness, from globalization and the energy transition, to digital technology, innovation and operational excellence, and products and services with greater added value. Tomorrow's factories will also include a new dimension with the advent of cyber-physical systems. Cyber-physical systems are comprehensive systems born of the convergence between energy and information technology. They depend on the widespread use of connected objects. Software plays a key role from simulation to production and facility management. And of course, people remain central. They will have to interact with these systems and make decisions more than ever. This transformation represents a formidable opportunity for industry. Software, and especially tools with powerful new simulation and augmented reality capabilities, will open the door to new possibilities in prototyping, maintenance, sales, and more. High energy efficiency plants will become a reality, with a 40% decrease in energy losses over the next two decades. Automation and robotics will, to an increasing extent, leverage industry-specific process knowledge, integrate independent decision-making capabilities, and be able to coordinate with other equipment to respond to production-related incidents. Sensors, which will be smart in communicating, will improve preventive maintenance, product traceability, quality control, and energy management. And to enable all of these connected objects to talk to each other, a common language, Ethernet IP, will make proprietary protocols a thing of the past. This will open the door to online services, machine-to-machine -machine communication, cloud computing, and big data. Schneider Electric sees the smart plant as the efficient internet-connected green plant. Fully internet-based Ethernet IP plant structure is the smart architecture for the smart plant. We've been gearing up for the transition to connected industry for quite some time now, and our solutions can help your business work towards the smart plant of the future, making this next industrial revolution an evolution.